Hi, I'm a student at UC Louvain in Belgium. And I'm from the University of Paris, France. The 25th to 27th of October, we participated at a hackathon organized by the Circle U Alliance. During those days, we had to tackle a big challenge, which is the burnout in the healthcare system. Let us take you on a tour of the great journey that we had. It all started the Monday evening at 6 p.m. We had an introduction with Emily, the facilitator who animated the hackathon. Since the sanitary situation, it was decided to run the hackathon online. We started the hackathon by dividing ourselves into teams. We then began an icebreaker to get to know each other better. Each team was assigned a coach, and once the teams were formed, three experts explained to us the challenges surrounding burnout in hospitals. Now that we had our brief on the challenge, we could prepare the interview we had with other international experts the next day. For this, we used an empathy map and a customer journey, tools frequently used by startups to help uncover critical needs. The next day, we started with a fun energizer. It was a good way to jump into action. We then had a speed meeting with an international panel of experts. It really helped us understand what lies behind the burnout problem. We brainstormed the rest of the morning, team by team. We used specific tools from the creative problem-solving approach to increase our creativity. This was a very efficient way to think outside the box. After we generated plenty of ideas, it was time to challenge the best ones with our coach. In the evening, once we had developed new solutions, we made a three-minute video pitch to convince on their relevance. The last day, the jury, composed of Circle U partners, gave constructive feedback on our solutions, but also feedback on our teamwork and the videos that we made. The solution pitch were really varied, from the interactive terminal to an artistic place where the staff could express their feelings. A team even had the idea of an empathic robot, we also were given a moment to debrief on the innovation processes and the overall experience. This was a very enlightening moment to understand what we had learned. I'm very glad to uh, have been involved in that project because uh, as a medical student, I've lived the complicated situations due to uh, the organization within the public hospitals. It was quite intense experience working like so many days with one group. Uh, it was uh, a good uh, way to learn about uh, time thinking and ways to, to find new ideas. I learned like ways to work in group and to make things work. In, in each of our uh, degrees, we lack team building activities. We lack the exposure to fields outside of our domain. If, if there's one thing we can all take away from here is the experience of having, trial, having worked outside of what, what is in our comfort zone. And I think that is very important, not just as a university student, but as an individual in itself. Students have been working for 24 hours. They have uh, made a huge effort, but they always kept energy very high. They smiled, they were motivated, and that brought me a lot of energy as well. Uh, it, was a, it was a great adventure. I met people that, uh, of different course of the University of Paris, and it was a, a great experience to build a project in uh, one and a half day. And uh, well, I'm happy uh, to be here. Thank you all for this joyful experience. And you, are you ready to jump on next year with a new challenge?